In this short video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to draw a polygon in your Vectric software. Over in the Design tab under Create Vectors, simply go into the Draw Polygon tool, click on that and that will open up the Draw Polygon form. So here you can specify the number of sides that you wish your polygon to have. You can do that by using the arrow buttons here, simply clicking on those. Alternatively, you could simply type in a value. In this case, I want to go with a polygon that has five sides. And then the easiest way for me to draw this out is simply coming into my job space. And then wherever I click using my left mouse key, I'm going to be able to draw out a polygon from the center where I've clicked. And um, when I click and drag with my mouse, you can see there that I'm able to see the size and shape of my part. And the more I drag out, the bigger the shape gets. And then if I drag that back in, we can see the smaller that shape gets. You can see next to my cursor, I'm also displayed the radius, which is super handy as it enables me to see the radius of my overall polygon shape. At the moment, it's at two inches. And if I'm happy with that, I can let go of my mouse and it will create that shape for me. And I can make further edits to my polygon should I need to by adjusting certain parameters. So here you can see we've got the radius displayed here. And if I wanted to alter that radius, I can simply alter this field here. For example, I could type in the value of one and it will adjust that there for me. Alternatively, I can actually take this handle and then I can adjust that like so. Now, if I wasn't bothered about the radius, but I was actually concerned about the side length, then I just simply adjust the side length field. For example, if I wanted a side uh, that is exactly three inches, I could type in three followed by the enter key, and then that will do that there for me. Now, if I wanted to create a direct duplicate of this based on the exact same sizes that we've got here, I can simply just click in position to create more shapes. If I wanted to edit an existing shape, I can simply hold down shift, select the shape I want to edit, in which case I can then make those edits and adjustments if I needed to. Now, if I wanted to look at altering the number of sides, I can just come over to the form and enter in a value or use the arrow keys and then press apply and it will update that there for me also. And then if we close out, you can see we've got all of our shapes here. And it's worth noting that once you have created your polygon, you can still access the crucial um, radius or side length whilst in transform mode. And you can do that again, just using that same handle. And so if you wanted to adjust the radius, to type in on the radius field here or pull on the handle. And likewise, if you wanted to adjust the side length, simply just update that value there. And if you wanted to go back into the Draw Polygon tool to edit the shape, you can also press E on the keyboard. And that's going to take you back into the form where you can make further adjustments. And that's how you draw polygons in Vectric software.